welcome back to my update for my transfer so finally i got you know married it's been a while since i've posted i did my in vitro in november of 2021 and we are in october november 2022 so i'm gonna update you on what's been going on um in september that's when we wanted to do our transfer so we had to go get checked with my doctor in monterrey so i went out there um we did some blood work she checked my uterus and everything was fine with my uterus the only thing that wasn't okay was my thyroid levels so the tsh it was super high like my levels were super high i think at an eight like 7.72 and that's the highest i've ever been so she got me on medicine and told me to start taking it once a day i'll show it to you right now um with that medicine i she told me to go get checked in two weeks to see if it was working let me go get it um so i decided to take it upon myself and go get checked in two weeks after that because i wanted to see if they were dropping or not because you know i'm just scared all the time so these are the ones she gave me it's levothyroxina sodica it's 50 mcg i know some people take more but that's what she told me to take and um i went two weeks after i started the meds to see if it went down and they went down by two it went down to a five point something and i was like yay like it's working you know october came along and it was time for the testing but it was just too much going on like too much stuff in my personal life like two of my grandparents passed and i didn't think it was the right time to go and you know go over there when all this is going on in my family within like three weeks of each other like i had one of my grandparents pass and then three weeks later my my grandma passed and then my grandpa passed three weeks after and it was just too much you know like too much too much to go over there like that wasn't even in my head anymore i was like no i have to stay with my parents so that didn't happen and now i am ready to go into the transfer this month so we're in november now that's why you see my christmas tree i already put it up because i love christmas like christmas is my favorite holiday um so i have instructions to go get checked to see what the next step is to see if my thyroid levels are good and stuff so my next video will be on that one more thing that my doctor had me taken were I mean, had me take wear some pills, but I can't remember the name, but I will show them to you next video. And sorry, I like look up a lot because I try and remember what I'm going to say. <laughs> but I will put my next video hopefully very soon to see what happens next. Hopefully it's my transfer video and I'm super excited. So I'm going to leave here a little clip of when I went to Monterrey because it's beautiful out there, out there. I'm from El Paso here, you know, it's super dry, like dry. Over there in Monterrey where I'm going, it's beautiful. There's hills, it's green, completely different than here. So I'll show you a little bit. And thank you for watching. I hope that my next video is very, very soon. And good luck to me. Thank you. Oh my God. I just realized que siempre ando heavy on the when I make videos. Like, why? <laughs> I promise next video I'll be ready. I'm going to show you a little bit of our trip that we went to back in September. Our room. Where's the light here? shower my best friend <laughs> and then 
the closet. We have to get two beds because all, that's all they had. It looks really nice though. And over here. Ooh, a little mini vanity. Cute. I wait for you. Oh, ow, ow, my arm. Did I just hurt my arm, babe? No? In the middle? Oh my goodness. So I view we can't see because it's at night. No way or nada. Oh, but that's the mall over there. Me dieron mi gorda que ya estaba poo me dejaron. You like poo? Centro de planchado. Oh, nice. And we're gonna knock out already. We're tired. Very, very tired. That is so pretty. The lobby is over there. Ready to go get that one done? <laughs> How pretty. Making gorditas. My gorditas. So up there they say that's like a dangerous colonia. Well, not dangerous, but like a criminal. And it's funny because it lands right to San Pedro. Like what? <laughs> the view over here is amazing. Look at the view from the restaurant here. And the hotel, it's so pretty. Fashion Drive is right across the street over there. And over there, over here, there's more restaurants. So the gym is right next to where we ate. Nice machines. So pretty here. It's so beautiful. The pool has a slide, how fun! We definitely need to come here this evening. And over there they have a park. So go check it out right now. And look at this amazing view. How pretty. I feel like everybody's looking at me because I'm recording, huh? Or maybe my outfit. Because look at me. <laughs> Being extra. Oh, nice. So our hotel has this pretty, pretty jardin. This is at our hotel. It's so pretty, so relaxing. Let's take some walks, babe. <laughs> Do some laps, please, sir. Get some booty. <laughs> this little jardin is here at our hotel and it's so pretty and so relaxing. And then you have the view. So we're staying at Safi Metro, what is it? Hold on, Safi, this one, this big building. It's in San Pedro Monterrey and it's like super nice here. So, so pretty. Fashion Drive is right there. 
I'm doing a lap here and going to the next pool just to check it out. We'll probably come later today, but I just want to see how it is. to get access. Oh look, that's for like the little kids wave in the corner. So second pool. So if you come to Madurai, you must stay here at least one day. Oh my gosh, you lucky without makeup because I was originally gonna stay only like 48-ish hours or a little bit less, not like 36. But then I missed my flight and you know, so I was like, screw it, I'm not gonna wear makeup because going to the hospital in the airport, you need the face mask. You know that all my makeup is like gone in places cause I don't know, like my makeup doesn't stay with the face mask. I guess, I guess because I talk a lot and you know how it rubs, I don't know. But my man's is back there. And it's so beautiful here. The sun, but it's so pretty. Right, babe? Yeah. <laughs> we came to a restaurant that Rodri loves. Ooh, it's through here. You want to be out here, babe? Yeah, no. So they have an outside little area is so cute look next door over there too oh it's so different here we came to eat here what really says that the food is really good he's obsessed with tacos okay. the Rodri's favorite place is right there the one next to the pink over here it's this one right here and estamos en un pueblito mágico Santiago, and that's all I know. <laughs> and there's a church over there. And we're just gonna wait here for Uber. We're not gonna go explore because we need to make it back to the hotel to go have dinner with Rodri's family. And we'll come back next time over here. Porque dicen que hay una cola de caballo that's so pretty. So there's another Virgencita here in the Pueblo Magico. This is the third one we see, I think. I'm like, is this a sign? Our last day in the day, this is so beautiful. Where we stayed is right over there. Babe. But yeah, it's so pretty here. How cute is this? I need one for my house, it's so tiny. It already is a cafe. 